Hello guys, this is Pawan Kumar and you are watching Arctic Studies. In this video, we are going to see some of the abbreviations asked in BRC entrance examinations like NATA, JE Men's Paper 2, AAT, UPSEE, MHCET, etc. and also MRC examinations like GATE Architecture. And not only from architecture examination but also many of the state level and central level entrance examinations, these types of questions are asked. So let's see what we have. So first one is DRDO, you will see the logo here and its full form is Defense Research and Development Organization. It is the premier agency under the Department of Defense Research and Development in Ministry of Defense of the Government of India and this is charged with the military's research and development headquartered in Delhi, India. Okay. So this is really important and it has been asked in many times in different examinations. So make sure you know all of these. Second is DDA, Delhi Development Authority. DDA is responsible for planning, development and construction of housing projects, commercial lands, land management, land disposal, land pooling, land costing, etc. So everything related to the construction comes in Delhi Development Authority that is DTA. Then we have CPWD, Central Public Works Department. Mission of CPWD is sound planning and design, engineered construction, effective maintenance, benchmarking the standards, capacity building, manpower planning and transparency in management of works. Similarly, each state has its own PWD that is Public Works Department. So all the construction related things happen in the state or whole of India. These are taken care by PWD and CPWD. Then we have LEAD. LEAD is Leadership in Energy and Environmental Design. It is a green building certification program used worldwide, developed by the non-profit US Green Building Council, USGBC. Okay, this is US Green Building Council, USGBC. So it's a certification program. It includes a set of rating systems for the design, construction, operation and maintenance of green building, homes and neighborhoods. Then we have IGBC. IGBC is Indian Green Building Council. Okay. So similar to this U USGBC, it is for India. Indian Green Building Council. IGBC is the first rating program developed in India exclusively for the residential sector. Okay. So this mainly focuses on residential sector then we have lnt lnt you might have heard so many times larson and tobro it is an indian uh, mnc which is multinational conglomerate company with business interest in engineering construction manufacturing technology information technology and financial services headquarters is in mumbai it mainly takes most of the like large projects like metros highways expressways all these are designed by LNT. Then we have BRO, Border Roads Organization. It is a road construction executive force in India that provides support to and is now a part of Indian Armed Forces. BRO develops and maintains road networks in India's border areas and friendly neighboring countries. Then we have NCPCI, National Payments Corporation of India, NPCI. This is the logo. It is an umbrella organization for operating retail payments and settlement systems in India. It is an initiative of the Reserve Bank of India and Indian banks. Okay. It's an organization. Then we have UPI. UPI is Unified Payments Interface. So UPI comes under NPCI. It's not an organization. It's a interface designed by NPCI. It is an instant real-time payment system developed by national payments corporation of india the interface facilitates interbank peer-to-peer -peer, okay interbank peer-to-peer -peer and person to merchant transactions so most of the applications like paytm phone pay google pay bharat pay all these use upi then we have bheem bheem is bharat interface for money it is an indian mobile payment app developed by the national payments corporation of india based on the unified payments interface so this was the first application with upi it was very famous in the initial days but now it is not as famous as all these payments apps then we have 
एन एच ए आई नेशनल हाईवेज अथॉरिटी ऑफ इंडिया एन एच ए आई इज एन ऑटोनोमस एजेंसी ऑफ द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया सेट अप इन नाइनटीन नाइनटी फाइव एंड रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर मैनेजमेंट ऑफ अ नेटवर्क ऑफ ओवर फिफ्टी थाउजेंड किलोमीटर ऑफ नेशनल हाईवेज आउट ऑफ वन लैख थर्टी टू थाउजेंड किलोमीटर इन इंडिया इट इज अ नोडल एजेंसी ऑफ द मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ रोड ट्रांसपोर्ट एंड हाईवेज ओके सो दिस कम्स अंडर मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ रोड ट्रांसपोर्ट एंड हाईवेज देन वी हैव एन टी पी सी नेशनल थर्मल पावर कॉरपोरेशन लिमिटेड द मेन एक्टिविटीज ऑफ द एन टी पी सी आर सेटिंग अप ऑफ पावर प्लांट्स एंड पावर जनरेशन थ्रू इट्स कोल बेस्ड एंड गैस बेस्ड पावर प्लांट्स द कंपनी इज ऑल्सो इन टू कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ हाइड्रो पावर प्लांट्स एंड जनरेशन ऑफ हाइड्रो पावर बिसाइड्स पावर ट्रेडिंग एंड डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिसिटी देन वी हैव इंडियन इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ आर्किटेक्ट्स आई आई ए ओके सो द इंडियन इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ आर्किटेक्ट्स इज द नेशनल बॉडी ऑफ आर्किटेक्ट्स इन इंडिया विद मोर देन वन लैख ट्वेंटी फोर थाउजेंड मेम्बर्स इट वॉज इस्टेब्लिश्ड इन नाइनटीन सेवेंटीन विद इट्स हेड क्वार्टर्स इन मुंबई इंडिया देन वी हैव यू आई ए इंटरनेशनल यूनियन ऑफ आर्किटेक्ट्स दिस माइट बी ट्रिकी यू आई ए इंटरनेशनल यूनियन ऑफ आर्किटेक्ट्स यू आई ए इज द ओनली इंटरनेशनल नॉन गवर्नमेंटल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन दैट रिप्रेजेंट्स द वर्ल्ड्स आर्किटेक्ट्स नाउ एस्टिमेटेड टू नंबर सम थ्री पॉइंट टू मिलियन इन ऑल देन वी हैव सी ओ ए काउंसिल ऑफ आर्किटेक्चर सी ओ ए इज चार्ज विद द रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी टू रेगुलेट द आर्किटेक्चर एजुकेशन एंड प्रैक्टिस ऑफ प्रोफेशन थ्रू आउट इंडिया बिसाइड्स मेंटेनिंग द रजिस्टर ऑफ आर्किटेक्ट्स सो वी कैन से दैट ऑल द थिंग्स रिलेटेड टू आर्किटेक्चर एंड इट्स एजुकेशन आर मैनेज बाई सी ओ ए लाइक नाटा एग्जामिनेशन ओके एंड लाइक रजिस्टरिंग ऑफ आर्किटेक्ट्स ऑल्सो द करिकुलम विच इज टॉट इन द कॉलेज इज ऑल्सो डिजाइंड एंड डिफाइंड बाय द काउंसिल ऑफ आर्किटेक्चर एंड देर आर सो मैनी अदर थिंग्स विच सी ओ ए डू देन वी हैव भेल भारत हैवी इलेक्ट्रिकल्स लिमिटेड Bell is an Indian central public sector undertaking and the largest government owned power generation equipment manufacturer okay it is an equipment manufacturer company then is ncert national council of educational research and training ncert is an autonomous organization set up in 1961 by the government of india to assist and advise the central and state governments on policies and programs for qualitative improvement in school education okay so this was all about this video and hope you learned something new and if that is so then please like this video share with the friends and subscribe this channel and don't forget to press the bell icon because that is what will get you a reminder when i upload any video in this channel